While power isn't the only issue for some homeowners, many are still cleaning up down trees and branches from their homes and yards. Lisa Washington shows us the damage in Edgeworth. We are in Edgeworth. This is near Sewickley and take a look. This is just one of several trees that fell when those strong storms moved through our area. The people we spoke with say they were surprised by the damage. They've never seen anything like this in their neighborhood. Sounded like the train coming right through our backyard. On Maple Avenue in Edgeworth, Mitch Woolbanks delayed his morning run to clean up branches that fell in his yard. We moved here from Houston two years ago and last time I've heard winds like that uh, were, were in Houston during uh, hurricanes. That was uh, some pretty strong, pretty strong storms. Fallen branches could be seen along Maple and other streets in Edgeworth, some leaning on houses. The wind was pretty ferocious. I've really never seen it so active. It was pretty wild to watch, that's for sure. Large tree trunks had to be cut into smaller pieces to be removed. Neighbors say the storms move through quickly, knocking out power and leaving a trail of damage in less than 15 minutes. All over, too. It's not one isolated area. It seems like all over Edgeworth. 